I'll see something when I believe it more than I'll believe something when I see it. Uh, who will share his thoughts on business success and his other interests following these messages. Joining us now from California is George Zimmer, the founder and chief executive officer of the Men's Warehouse. George, it's a real pleasure to have you on the show. How are you doing, sir? I guarantee it. You're the founder of a public company and you've been at the helm of this company for over 38 years and you're still just as involved as ever. What are the things that continue to motivate you to come into work every day? I guarantee it means. Well, that's certainly very impressive. Let me ask you what you regard as the most important ingredients that you attribute your company's success to. I guarantee it means. Would you say the lessons you've learned are also applicable to non-retail businesses? I guarantee it means. Interesting. So many things are all about trust. I'd like to ask you about your philanthropic endeavors. I understand you're involved with quite a number of these. Please tell our audience about the causes and the organizations that you support. I guarantee it means. I share your thoughts on animal rights and the cruelty and exploitation animals and the environment are subjected to. And these words come to my mind. I guarantee it means. Until he extends his circle of compassion, to include all living things, man will not himself find peace. Albert Schweitzer said that, and I respect you also for your down-to-earth philosophy and ideas. I understand you're interested in many other things also, including education, of course. So please tell our audience why you believe in today's world there's a greater need than ever for lifelong learning. I guarantee it. Now you're hitting another hot button with me because I'm quite critical of a lot of the TV programming the public has shown on television worldwide. So much of it is rubbish and on the other hand, there are also some redeeming features, a lot of excellent educational programs on the Learning Channel, the Science Channel, PBS and National Geographic, for example. Yet there's so much meaningless trash out there, along with negative content that in my opinion is harmful and undermines values and society in general. What are your thoughts on this? I, oh, I couldn't agree. All we can do is try and apply our good ideas in this world and try and make a difference. I'd like to change subjects again and ask you about healthcare. George, I recently interviewed the author of a powerful new book entitled Pharmocracy, which states that misguided medical regulations are bankrupting America. Please share some of your views on that subject. I guarantee it. Interesting thought. I'd say that must be a controversial topic in many people's minds. I guarantee it. I'd like to change subjects again, if you don't mind, George, and ask you how you see the challenges facing the United States of America at this time in history. I guarantee it. I think that's an excellent idea. I'd like us to continue with these subjects, but we have to take a break for a moment for these commercial messages, and we'll continue in just a moment. Yes, I guarantee it.